If you're looking for the best ways to manage your money, you've come to the right place. We have compiled for you a list of the world's top 10 personal finance books that can help you in managing your money. They can teach you the most basic tips of personal financing, such as how to pay off a debt or how it is ideal to pay yourself first, which can help you deal with your money in a more smart and confident manner. That's not all. These books can tell you how to deal with a mortgage, how to find the ideal place to invest, and how to save for your retirement using a nest egg. And learning to navigate these will result in a successful and healthy relationship between you and your money. You might be thinking, this is no light reading, and you're right. But this reading is what your wallet will be guaranteed to thank you for. Here's our list of the top 10 personal finance books. Number 1. Why didn't they teach me this in school? Each and every one of us wishes that we'd been taught more about money in school, especially on how to professionally handle our finances. All this information can be found in Carrie Siegel's book, Why Didn't They Teach Me This in School? Carrie Siegel himself is a retired business executive and he speaks from immense experience. The book comprises 99 different principles along with 8 varying lessons about money which should have been taught to you in college or even in high school. The initial intention of Siegel when writing this book was to teach all the important personal finance principles to his five children that they should grow up while learning before they enter the real world. However, the popularity of the book increased as it turned into one of the most reviewed personal finance books filled with some of the most important financial lessons as well as personal advice from the author himself. The book follows a pattern that is easy to read and is the best choice for fresh graduates as well as for anyone who is aiming to find the right way to embark on a personal finance journey. Number 2. Rich Dad, Poor Dad Rich Dad, Poor Dad is a book by Robert Kiyosaki that you are likely to have heard of since it has been around for more than two decades, and with valid reasons for that as well. The poor dad in his book is his father, while the rich dad is his father's friend. In his book, Kiyosaki elaborates on all the lessons and secrets that he learned from the pair while growing up. Some of these lessons include the claims that you can be rich without making a lot of money, as well as explaining the concepts of assets and liabilities. The book also reaches out to parents and explains why knowledge regarding personal finance should be given to their kids but isn't. An update from the author is also included in the 20th anniversary edition which includes an update on the economy as well as investing. Number 3. The Total Money Makeover A major aspect of personal finance is how you manage your overall debts. If you're looking for help in that domain, Dave Ramsey has a perfect solution for you. His book, The Total Money Makeover. This book is a record bestseller in the New York Times and has explained important concepts in simple words. According to the book, the secret behind freeing yourself from debt is to steer clear of easy pitfalls, such as the use of credit or cash advances. The book also provides in its snowball method an insight into how to start an emergency fund that you can later use as a saving plan for retirement or use it to pay for college for your children. Number 4. The Automatic Millionaire The Automatic Millionaire by David Back is a bestseller in the New York Times, the Bloomberg Business Week, the USA Today, as well as the Wall Street Journal, and it is for all those who dream of turning into millionaires. The book sheds light on the life story of a couple who earn $55,000 annually, combined which helped them finally reach their financial dreams. You might wonder how they did it, how they owned two different houses, put their children through college, and then retired at the age of 55 with a retirement savings of $1 million. The solution, as provided by David Back, is to establish an automatic paying system that pays you first. Back also claims that smart women, smart couples, and starting late are all key points in finishing the race rich. Number 5. Broke Millennial do you know about the hashtag GYFLT on social media? If you don't, then it means get your financial life together. And if you want to do that, then this book is for you. 
Broke Millennial is a book by Erin Laurie and it talks about how 20-year-olds can control their personal finances and gain success. This book covers important money issues faced by all millennials today, including the struggle to manage student loans, helping them understand their relationship with money, as well as the details of how much and how to share your financial details with your partner. Number 6. The One-Page Financial Plan if you're a young, confused individual with any questions about how to handle anything related to your money, then this book is for you. It answers questions about how to invest and how to face financial challenges that come up unexpectedly. The author of this book, Carl Richards, is a certified financial planner as well as a columnist for the New York Times. He provides a solution to all the basic questions so that you can get an intro on how to manage your finances. Not only that, but the book also helps you identify your financial goals while providing a simple one-page plan towards achieving those. Number 7. I will teach you to be rich. If you think that being rich is all about spending money, then this book will prove you wrong. I Will Teach You to Be Rich is a book by Ramit Sethi, who is a financial expert and a bestseller in the Wall Street Journal as well as the New York Times. Sethi has elaborated on how you can spend money without feeling guilty. The secret is investing and allocating it properly. The book also sheds light on how to handle various types of pitfalls, such as student loans, while also teaching the ideal way to save every month. The book even tells you how you can talk your way out of paying any late fees. Sounds pretty cool, doesn't it? The 10th anniversary edition of the book has included the success stories of some of the readers of the book who have been able to use Sethi's book to get rich. A neat flex indeed. Number 8. Clever Girl Finance It is an undeniable statistic that with every dollar a man earns, a woman earns only 0.82 cents. While comparing mothers to fathers, for every dollar that a father earns, the mother earns just 71 cents. It can easily be concluded from these facts that in today's time, women feel forced to work harder to earn the same amount of money. Clever Girl Finance is a book by Bola Shukambi, who is the CEO and founder of the website Clever Girl Finance as well as a certified financial education instructor, aims to educate as well as empower entire generations of women on staying on top of things such as keeping a track of finances, outlining and managing a budget, building a nest egg, the right way to managing credit, and also teaching them how to take their financial well-being into their own hands. Number 9. The Psychology of Money This book highlights an interesting psychological perspective on how money is connected to your ego as well as to preconceived notions. It also dives into the effects that pride can have on the financial decisions that you make. Involving ego and pride in managing money is not the ideal choice for managing your investment portfolio. The Psychology of Money is a book written by Morgan Housel, who is a columnist at the Wall Street Journal, as well as a partner at the Collaborative Fund. This book gives profound insight to the readers along with tools and tips compiled in 19 different short stories that can be used to combat such biases. Number 10. Your Money or Your Life your Money or Your Life is a book by Vicky Robin that explains a 9-step plan that is easy to follow and guides the reader towards changing their relationship with money. The book has more than a million copies and is a solution to various questions such as how to begin investing, how to build up wealth, how to come out of debt, and even something so simple as how to save money. On top of that, the book contains a mindfulness technique which can be used to answer all these questions. With that said, that's all that we have for you guys today. Do you feel like we missed out on any book? Well, then tell us in the comment section below. If you've read any of these, then comment your opinion as well. Before you leave, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more from our channel. Until next time, see you later!